I saw a dog out here earlier running around on its own. We live in one of those neighborhoods where like on trash day, there's stray dogs. <laughs> like on cartoons. Uh, that's my reality. We live in one of those neighborhoods where on trash day, there's stray dogs. And it's trash day. And there was a dog out already. You ever imagine the dog catchers out there catching dogs? Because the dog catchers don't come to our neighborhood. So I really like my neighborhood. But I used to live in a nice neighborhood. And if there was just like one stray animal, the dog catcher would show up. Now I live in a different neighborhood and literally there can be like 10 stray dogs running in a pack tearing up people's trash and the dog catcher's nowhere to be found. When I was a kid, because of cartoons, I was always worried that the dog catcher was gonna come catch my dogs even though my dogs weren't running wild. I don't know what I thought. The dog catcher was gonna get a, a net and like take my dogs out of my backyard. Speaking of dogs messing with the trash, we also have people that mess with the trash. Like, first these like bicycle scouts come out. It's like two or three that are there every trash day. They drive by each street on their bicycle and look down the street and they look for like furniture out there, like valuable stuff I guess. And uh, I suppose they call their friends or their the, whoever, works, whoever works this operation with them and they'll be like, hey man, there's a really nice used toilet out on Beltline. Uh, I guess they call their I guess they call their cohorts put out some nice stuff on trash day Literally because I knew it wasn't gonna get thrown away. I put out a really crappy sofa once It was scratched up and it wasn't worth much even even when it was even when it was in good condition It wasn't worth much. I put it out on trash day. Whoa my lane's ending. Why my lane ending? I put it out on trash day I knew it was gonna go to a good home because there was no way the trash men were gonna make it there before the scavengers did and I was right. A friend of mine that lives in our neighborhood has had somebody to like try to take his lawnmower. Like while he, he was gonna mow and he had it out there. There's a pros and cons to having trash scavengers in your neighborhood. You can throw things out that you want to go to a good home and they will go to a good home. But at the same time, you've got scavengers in your neighborhood. If you're a trash scavenger, leave me some comments down there. Let me know how it works. I hope I'm not just stereotyping you. My mom watches my YouTube comments and she will text me and be like, XYZ said this on this video Like if somebody leaves some explicit comments or some spam or anything that's not nice So rest assured haters my mom's watching 